Are you ready to challenge your visual memory? Let's go. Take a look at the following images and try to memorize them in detail. Can you find the correct fruit among these four options? This one. What about these four houses? The second one is correct. And now let's see if you can spot the right bottle. There it is. Great job. And now let's go ahead and make the task a little harder. Try to memorize these five objects. Can you find the correct flower among these four options? Although these flowers are the same purple color, only the second one matches the original. Can you recognize the lemon? It's this one. Let's see if you can find the right bag. There it is. What about the slippers? It's the first pair. You probably remember the original burger, don't you? There it is. Next round, try to memorize these five images. Can you find the correct mushroom among these five options? Well, hello. Let's see if you can find the correct berry. There it is. Let's try to spot the original ice cream. Only this one is correct. Can you find the original star among these five images? There it is. What about the bee? Can you see it? Oh, hi. Next round. Take a look at these images. Now let's try to find the original star among these six images. The first one. What about these six options? Can you see the correct flower? The fifth one is correct, but the second flower is from the previous task, so it may also seem familiar to your brain. Go ahead, can you find the bag? This one is correct. Does the third option remind you of something? This is the bag from the second round. Can you find the original house among these six images? There it is. What about these six options? Can you see the original cat? Here it is. Can you find the correct dog? It's the second one. Next challenge. Focus on these images and try your best to memorize the order. And now, let's close these images. Can you remember what's hidden under the third card? The bagel. What about the sixth card? The mug. What about the first card?
It's our B. Now, the second card. The candy. What's hiding under the fourth card? The socks. Can you remember what the fifth card hides? The shoe. Let's move on to the next challenge and try to memorize these images. Let's cover the images. Can you see through the fifth card? It's the ring. What can you say about the third card? The banana. What about the sixth card? It's the apple. Can you remember what image was under the first card? The book. What about the second card? It's the phone. Can you remember what image hides under the fourth card? The glasses. Great job. Next round. Okay, let's hide these images. Can you remember what's hidden under the sixth card? The sunflower. What about the first image? It's the orange. Can you guess what image is hiding under the fifth card? It's the cloud. What can you say about the third card? It's the glove. And what about the second one? The scissors. What image is under the fourth card? It's the flower. What can you say about the eighth card? It's the car. What about the seventh? The tree. Let's make this task a little harder. Try to memorize these 10 images. Let's close the images. Can you remember where the doctor is hiding? Over there. What about the rose? It's hiding under the seventh card. Can you find the hand? It's here. Let's try to find the strawberry. Hey! Next round, let's focus on these 10 images. Time's up. We're covering the images. Can you remember the correct location of the key? It's over here. Can you figure out where the swan is hiding? Behind the eighth card. What about the clover? Here it is. Let's try to find the mug. It's 
It's over there. What about the sun? It's behind the seventh card. And now, try to memorize these vegetables. Time's up. Let's hide them. Can you remember the correct location of the garlic? Right. Where is the corn hiding? It's under the sixth car. What about the pumpkin? It's over there. Where's the carrot? Under the fifth card. Do you remember where the onion is? It's under the seventh card. And what about the eggplant? Oh, there it is. Next round. You have just a few seconds to memorize the following images. And now let's hide them and try to figure out where the burger is. It's over there. Can you remember where the donut is? It's hiding under the third card. What about the pizza? It's over there. Where's the ice cream? It's hiding behind the eighth card. What about the cheese? Over there. Can you spot the sandwich? It's hiding under the ninth card. Great job! That's it for today. So hey, if you pacified your curiosity, then give the video a like and share it with your friends. Or if you want more, just click on these videos and stay on the bright side. All right, let's see how good you are at remembering details. Take a close look at the images. After seven seconds, one element will be gone. Your task is to name it. You get one point for each correct answer. Let's start with an easy one to warm up your brain. Just a peaceful alpine landscape interrupted by a speed train. Okay, I hope you had enough time to remember it in detail. What is missing now? The bottom of the girl's staff is gone, so I guess it's useless now. Moving on. Two noble knights are trying to win over the princess's heart. I don't know who's going to win, but I'm sure something is missing in this image. Oh no, the princess has lost her beautiful tiara. Next, looks like a typical day at some startup's office. Sure, they wouldn't mind some changes. And there you go. One of the plants is missing. Now they can just use it as another coffee mug. How about this one? This bus must be headed to that startup's office from the previous picture. Now, what's the difference between the two images? One of the girls is missing glasses. Did you notice it? These guys must be having a heck of a time. What if we change something here? Voila! What's missing? Mmm, it's a tricky one. 
looks like some of the ports on the back of the TV set are now missing. I wonder if they can still play their games without those. Ugh, I'm feeling hungry. Time to go grocery shopping. So many things to choose from. And now one of them is gone. I know, I know, a milk carton on the top shelf went missing. Must have landed in someone's shopping cart. Three friends went on a safari. They saw some rhinos, hippos, and whatnot. And then, in the blink of an eye, something was different about that African landscape. Do you see it? One of the guys has lost his travel mat. A hippo will definitely take good care of it. Something's always going on at the airport. One second, and it's all different. The guy in the back should have kept an eye on his belongings. His briefcase is gone. Buying flowers for someone you love is always a good idea. This little shop has an impressive choice, but that might be about to change. Whoa, I was looking at the flowers, but the missing detail here is one of the bricks. Surprise, surprise! That's one happy girl. Looks like she just finished decorating her apartment. It looks perfect, except one detail is missing now. Hmm. It's the middle line on one of the vases. That moment you arrive at college on your classy new motorbike, nothing can possibly go wrong. Well, it did, as one item is missing in this image. Can you tell what it is? It's the clock. A good excuse for being late to class. All aboard the pirate ship, the oceans are awaiting. Aye, but first, let's find one detail that's missing here. Arr, that was a tricky one. Jolly Roger is definitely missing here, and a pirate is not a pirate without it. The hat is called a tricorn, by the way. <laughs> Let's move from a pirate ship back to big city life. The passengers are all going somewhere, and who knows what's going to happen the next moment. Can you tell what's different now? Found it! The girl's backpack is missing a handle. That's one lucky guy. Looks like he got the golden ticket. Oops, and now something is missing here. Hope it's not the lucky golden ticket. It's the minute hand on that wall clock in the back. Did you spot it? I'm getting hungry. Again. Hope this guy can help me out with some pasta or whatever he's cooking out there. Except... Something is off here now. I hope it doesn't slow down the cooking process. Yep, one of the tomatoes is missing. Gotta find it and put it back. Now, let's spice things up a bit. You'll be looking for two missing details in every image, not one. Someone has a car to fix at this auto repair shop. Try to remember every detail. It's the little things that matter. And now, can you find two details that are missing? It's the red cap on the canister and one of the crosses on the chalkboard. Moving on to the next image. Just a typical classroom where not every student is equally excited about what's going on. Now, what's missing here?
the guy in the red hoodie won't write much without a pencil. And the girl in the back has a new hairstyle now. Her ponytail is gone. Everybody has their idea of a perfect morning. See that guy sleeping right on the lawn? Eh, That would be me. But everything is about to change here. And voila! Two things are missing. Can you name them? One of the balls is now missing, as well as that tower on top of one of the skyscrapers. Ready for the next one? Looks like this guy has just inherited a good amount of money. But what is this mess all about? Anyway, your task is to find the two missing pieces of this puzzle. The bottle that used to be right here on the bookshelf is gone. And one of the spots on the window followed it. It looks better now. Time for another one! This couple must be headed home for the weekend while their less fortunate colleague has to stay in the office. They're waving goodbye to him and two details that were in the picture. One of the notes is gone. And the lucky guy just lost some blush off of his cheek. Did you notice that? This guy sure has a lot of books to read. 3, 2, 1, and something is gone. I knew it! It was the book right here and this whole pile on the top shelf. This image seems peaceful and simple, but just wait. Are you sure something has changed? It looks exactly the same to me. Oh, right! I can see that the horse is missing its plow, and the tree has lost most of its leaves. I gotta admit, things are getting trickier and trickier. Your new task is to find three missing objects. Looks like these guys can't decide who has to clean up today. Let's see if moving things around a bit can help them. So, the note on the fridge is missing, the bucket no longer casts a shadow, and the dishwashing liquid is gone. These ladies seem so sweet. Can you help them find three missing elements in their portrait? Well, you can't pour any water out of this watering can. And one of the ladies has lost two elements of her adorable smile. The mountains are calling, and I must go. But before I join this guy, you gotta name the three things missing in this new image. There are no more knots on the backpack, and the guy has lost his bangs. And look at that mountaintop! It's completely different now. I can't tell if they're playing some game or trying to catch a bat in their backyard. Anyway, the task remains the same for you. Only the most attentive of you must have noticed the glass is now empty. One door is missing a handle. And the plant right here is missing one of its leaves. Want to go horse riding? Oh no, things are all messed up now. Can you bring them back to normal? The horse is missing a part of its bridle. One of the apples must have fallen off the tree. And that tiny window in the back is gone. Congrats! You've reached the champion's level! You'll see images moving on the screen. Your task will be to name one detail that's off. Let's start with an easy one. It seems perfectly normal, but there must be something wrong here. Ah, there's no river on the other side of the bridge. Next, please. Hmm, 
Hmm, I know, the wind can't be blowing in different directions. What about this one? So many details to consider. I hope you notice what's wrong here. The traffic light has no red. Must be pretty chaotic out there. And another one for you to figure out. This street doesn't look nearly as busy as the previous one. This one seems just fine to me. Can you tell what's not okay in this image? There can't be two suns in the sky. So, if you got over 20 points, you have an incredibly sharp eye. You could start a career as a detective, unless you already have one. If you've got 10 to 20 points, your visual memory is better than that of most people. You're attentive to details, and it helps you a lot. If you got less than 10 points, you tend to see the big picture rather than the little things. If it worries you, try solving more visual riddles.